many of us struggle with tenses in English. Everybody knows there are three tenses, present, past, future, and four different branches for it. So altogether it becomes 12 tenses. And we know we have been studying this, but still we get stuck when we use it and we are very confused whether it is correct or not. And even if we start to study that, it takes ages to finish it. And everybody has tried it from schools and colleges, but still we are worried. We are not confident to use it, to use the tenses appropriately when we make conversations, when we write or whenever we use language, literally. In this video, you will learn to use these 12 tenses and you can learn that by just watching this video. Watch this video repeatedly and you'll be fine. Do the exercise that you're going to say in this video. Do that several times and you'll be fine. So let's get started. All right, so the idea uh, of learning these 12 tenses in English is by using your hands. We're going to use the fingers and the hand. All you need to do is to repeat what I say and do what I do with my fingers and with my hand. By repeatedly doing this, I will guarantee you that you will remember this longer and you'll be able to use it uh, without confusion and difficulty. All right, so let's do this. Simple present, simple past, simple future, present, continuous. Now we move the hand like this because it's a continuous action, so we move the hand. So once again, present continuous, past continuous, and future continuous. So basically, this is the middle part is present, and this is past, and this is future. So once again, from the beginning, simple present, simple past, simple future, present continuous, and past continuous, future continuous. Now we finished six tenses, the names of it. So next, present perfect. So this action denotes perfect. So present perfect, past perfect, future perfect, present perfect, continuous. Again, you move your thumb because it's uh, a continuous action. So we add this movement to the present perfect and it becomes present perfect, continuous. Present perfect, continuous, past perfect, continuous, and future perfect continuous. So that concludes the names of the tenses. So let's do that again and see if you can remember. Simple present, simple past, simple future, present continuous, past continuous, and future continuous. Present perfect, past perfect, and future perfect. Present perfect, continuous, past perfect, continuous, and future perfect continuous. Now these are the names of the 12 tenses. Learning just the name is not going to help us to use to produce the language. We also have to be able to make sentences using these 12 tenses. And that's the next stage which will be covered in the next video. So these are the names of the tenses, just the names of the tenses and, and we know that learning just the names of the tenses is not going to help. We need to be able to produce sentences using these tenses and we should be able to use it when we speak or write. So in the next video, I'm going to talk about different sentences using the tenses and how you can allocate and how you can easily understand those tenses and use it uh, again using the hand gestures we just finished explaining, which will be covered in the next video. So I'll see you in the next one.